Welcome to another N8N -N tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you another way to install it locally. All right. I have another video that shows how to install it using Docker. Now I'm going to show you how to use it using Node.js. All right. So in your search bar, just type in Node.js right here and click on the first search result. Don't from here, just click on download Node.js and uh, proceed with the download process right here. So you can see it's almost done. Now it's done, just click on it to open up the installer. Now that it's open, just click on next, accept, next, next, next. Install the necessary tools, next, install. That will be a prompt, just click on yes and to wait for the process to finish. As you can see here, it's done. I'm going to hit on finish. And we're going to press any key to continue to do it with the process again. Hit on yes. There'll be a prompt right here. So it says type enter to exit. Just hit on enter. So the process is done. Let's go ahead and check it out. If it has successfully installed, just open up your command prompt and type in node space dash dash version hit enter so we have installed this successfully and the, the latest version is installed and what we're going to do next is again open up our web browser i'll go ahead and open up a new tab i'll type in n8n space npm all right hit on enter here in the first link click on it So as you can see here, this will be the uh, package that we're going to need. So to install it, just open up your CMD again, command prompt. Now type in npm i n a n minus g and to hit on enter. Minus g right here if you want it to install globally. If not, just uh, erase minus g. Doesn't matter. Now from here, just let's just wait for the process to finish as it will take some time. It will take about a good uh, th three to five minutes. All right, just wait for it. All right, it's done. Just type in NA10 and hit on enter. There'll be a prompt, just hit on allow. And it says here, press O to open in browser. If not, you can just go ahead and copy this one or directly click on it. All right, if, if it's not gonna work, Paste that in here. And there you have your N8N dashboard. Well, I hope this video helps and uh, I'll see you in the next one.